Hello everybody! Welcome back to the Wizards. Yeah, I noticed in my, uh, uh, alone playthrough of the game, there's actually a little place down here too. Please excuse that I won't be coming out to meet you. I am yet to recover from all that I've seen in my travels. Nothing short of the end of the universe, I tell you. Interesting, I'm guessing this is his little place then. Seem pretty interesting, little mushrooms and stuff, but yeah. Kind of cool, kind of cool. Really hidden, but you know, like not that hidden, but hidden enough I didn't see until I, after I had pretty much played through the whole game. <laughs> Alright, yep, so now we're heading this way. Yeah, I already colored my gloves. Alright, yeah, let's continue. The story, whoo. Ah, a new adventure. Grim as the times are, each new beginning still has its charm. Oh, whoa. Oh, yeah, this fire is a move. I, mean, I don't remember that weird statue before. I always like trying to see the places it'll let me teleport to. <laughs> Not like I could go up there. But I'm pretty sure I'm going to be walking up there soon anyways. Oh, there's a little spider thing. I've seen some of them before. First thought they were enemies and I tried to hit them, but that didn't work. Alright. I do like this environment. Very cool. Vertical. A lot of birds. Jeez. It's ominous. It's a long trek to Twilight Peak from here. But with any luck, you should find more element cores to complement your arsenal on the way. Oh, that's cool. Jeez, yeah, I didn't notice any of these sections before, I don't think. Oh, I know, I, I do actually remember this because I remember throwing a fireball at it. <laughs> okay, see, look, that was the one I had seen. Weird little spider thing. Definitely is creepy looking. Can't hurt it though. And try and push off the edge. There we go, perfect. You carry light. Help me out. I can't move through these vines. Please take them off me. Thank you. Stand back now. Yes, good friendly ogres. Oh, I'm trying to... Um. You're welcome! Yes, yes, thank you. It's good to see the more thick-skinned locals still resist Umbra's influence. <laughs> I do like seeing friendly people. Be gone! That's cool. I love breaking them when they're ice. That's always fun. Oh, that's something that probably should be looked at. <laughs> that's one problem this game you find quite often is, you know, just little things like that. Alright, which way am I supposed to go in exactly? I doubt this is the right way. Oh yeah, definitely not. Can I get up there? All right. I do like that little that you can do that. And for right, this is ice, so yeah. Yeah, first time I seen a red one of those, I like looked at it and then hit it, and it blew me up. It didn't kill me, but it wasn't fun. Oh, you can actually climb up this one. Oh, 
Oh, you can't actually teleport over here. I wonder if there's anything interesting. Oh, I think it's just a... Yeah, I could have walked up there. Yeah, see, I think it was actually those that I blew up. <laughs> yeah, I think I'm supposed to head this way now. Maybe. Can I even go this way? Nah, nah. Okay. This way then. Another save point. There's quite a lot of these around. Which is nice. Some of the fights later on get really hard. Which I'm kind of glad. I'm glad this game isn't like just a cakewalk. Now there is one thing though in the game. There's a spell later on that is like probably should be nerfed. It's it's nuts how powerful it is. Oh, I didn't even realize you do that. You can send the arrows back. Dang it. <laughs> okay. Okay, you can't hurt him with him though. That was pretty cool though, yeah. I had no idea you could throw the arrows back, but I'm pretty sure I hit him and it didn't do nothing. Walk around the sludge. Oh. <laughs> Jeez, I messed up. I hit the top trigger, so I didn't make a force push thing. Oh well. That was a point. Sorry, the game's real easy, but you know, everything is falling apart. Makes sense. Yeah, this is kind of an interesting part right here because you can climb up either side, or you can go up this middle, which is. I don't know why it gives you the option for all these, because none of them seem to really do much. Now, it's kind of weird that you can climb like that through it, because you can literally just grab here and start. Real confusing. Last time I think it went that way and just went around the houses, which is kind of weird, because you just kind of walked up behind this guy. I don't even think that happened last time. I don't remember fighting one of these guys here, jeez. That is not gonna do much. That, that's what I'm trying to do. Oh, crap. Elven architecture used to be quite interesting. It's a shame to see these crude constructions take its place. The unlit have no finesse. Ooh, that was, that was interesting. Yeah, because I really don't remember fighting him last time. I wonder if that's the difference with the story mode or what. Because, yeah. Yeah, quite a little area over here. Because, yeah, you can get to a lot of different places. Because, like, yeah, that... That thing would only, all that uh, one climbing part did, all it did was like bring you through back here. 
then you would have ended up back here where you could have climbed up to the one guy. But yeah, I really don't remember fighting that guy. The ice guy. Interesting. Alright, anyway, let's continue. I think we go down the whale. Looks worth a shot, don't you think? No water in the well. The entire region is out of balance. Alright. Could climb down those, but meh. <laughs> we have oh. company! These little things. I think they call them darklings or something. They throw bombs at you. They're nasty. But they have like, they die real easily. Goodness, the Darklings are such pests. The gloom has somehow made them even worse than they were before corruption. <laughs> yeah, they were called Darklings. Cool, I remembered. All right. Ooh, which way is the right way? I know one of these, I'm pretty sure, leads to a secret thing. That looks more like a right way. <laughs> okay, they both look very much like the right way. Oh. I hear uh, one of those little mushroom explodey guys. They have like this weird little squeaky voice kind of a deal. Alright, nope, this was the right way. Let me head back real quick then. Just, just darn it. Why is it being such a pain? Really? It's forcing me to stay up? That's a pain. That's freaking retarded. <sighs> yeah, that's real damn annoying. Because there's really no reason I can't go back, but whatever. I mean, I did feel that little lag spike. I'm pretty sure I was just that despawning in this rest of this place coming up. Okay, I don't want to miss what it's showing right now. Such heat is not natural. We might be coming up on another element core. Yeah, the dragon. That's pretty cool. Jeez. Okay, yeah, I know that was all that was back here. Ah, I'm real pissed about that. That was that's annoying. Oh well. If I remember I don't think it was that important. Like it wasn't a color or anything. Obstacles do get in the way a lot of fighting. Oh, 
why that one fireball didn't hit the... Wow, none of the fireballs hit him. That's weird. Kind of on the next little boss fight here. Nothing will grow in its place as long as the cord of fire remains here unprotected. That was not who I wanted the fireball to hit. God damn it! Yeah, this guy he is he is tough. Hello, hit that thing. All oh, right, it's fire. Shield, god damn. Yeah, the first time I fought this guy, I accidentally walked into that portal right there. <laughs> so I'm staying down here this time. Good. I always like finish those guys off like that. <laughs> ah, this is a pretty cool area. I like crystals. And these things, they, they look kind of weird because they're just like little kind of cartoony 2D images and then, yeah. I think they could have done better with how those things looked. <laughs> Alright, this one is pretty oh, cool. Rush. This so, spell will do quite nicely against anyone standing in your way. That's yeah, another combo spell, yeah. You use it, it's with the fireball now though, but yeah, now you grab the fireball and you turn it into this, then you can... Yeah, and you can like control when it explodes and you can just let it go all the way out. Pretty good, real strong. Remember, right, we have a part up here where it's very useful. The air is so dry. This can't oh. be a good environment for the tree life. Yeah, see, since the uh, gate's the blocking it, you can't just spirits. straight up fire. You can't just straight up fireball this. So, gotta do this. Yeah. Then up here is a part where it's very useful because there's a ton of guys. Oh, I missed. Small potatoes, these. Oh, what the heck? How did that miss? Something coming up here is a ton of those uh, little guys. Is there anything over here? This place looks kind of interesting. Nope. But yeah, a ton of the, uh, what they're over there called, the little mushroom dudes. Like a ton. Just in case there's more. Yeah, it was a lot. I didn't use this thing last time to fight him, and it was kind of a mistake. Yeah, I do like that spell. It's just sadly it comes to a point where it's not super useful just because a lot of enemies are not like on the ground level with you. So, better use it as much as possible. Very cool. Alright guys. That is actually going to do it for this episode. Got pretty far through the first area. So, yep, now we're on the second. Woohoo. That's going to do it for this one. See ya.